Award winners. We're going MVP Cy Young Rookie of the Year. My AL MVP is Shohei Otani. I didn't. I wanted to take Jose Ramirez, but what the fact that Otani was in the conversation after Judge's year last year makes it like this guy has like he's gonna win it every year basically unless someone keeps doing a Judge year. Mm-hmm. NL. I'm going Juan Soto. I think keep an eye on Francisco Ta- or sorry Fernando Tatis and Trey Turner as well. But I think Soto has an insane bounce back year and is a huge piece. What about you? So for the AL, I'm gonna go with Shohei. Yeah. As well, and then the NL, I'm going with Bryce Harper. Um, I think the, obviously I think that the Phillies are going to have a sick year and I think he's going to be the biggest part and mm-hmm. the biggest reason that that happens. Um, he's just fucking gross. Yeah, he's, he's so nasty. good. Um, Cy Young, AL, I'm going Shane Bieber. I think the Guardians will be good this year. Also keep an eye out for Alex Manaya, uh, for the Blue Jays and Logan Gilbert. That is my AL. And then NL, Corbin Burns, I said it already, uh, strikeout monster i think this guy's gonna be disgusting and then zach wheeler and zach allen are two guys i'd want to watch out for there i'm gonna go with a hot take for the nl i am gonna go with aaron nola i I like that i think that he's disgusting i like that um and then i think he really proved himself in the postseason last Mm, year uh in the a i'm gonna go with another hot take i've been talking about the whole episode i legitimately think this guy's the best pitcher that the yankees have it's carlos rodon I, and I think he's going to win the Cy Young wow, for the Yankees. That would be huge for them. And then to wrap it all up, Rookie of the Year, I'm going AL, Yoshi. Mazataka same, Yoshi. They got the same guy. He is a same beast. Um, I'd also look at Anthony Volpe, especially if he starts in the on the Yankees roster, which it seems like he will. Gunnar Henderson for the Orioles. Logan O'Hop. Um, another guy to keep an eye out on. NL, I'm going Corbin Carroll um, for the Diamondbacks. I think he's mm-hmm. going to be disgusting. He's going to be great. Also look at Kodai Senga yep. for the Mets, Jordan Walker for the Cardinals, Ellie De La Cruz, definitely throw some money on him because watch out for the Reds, and Brett Beatty for the Mets if he gets an everyday role. That is my rookie of the year pick. I'm going to go Kodai Senga. Yep. Um, I, I just, anyone who watches hockey, you remember when Artemi Panarin became a rookie with the Blackhawks, came over from Russia. It's a very similar thing with these guys coming over from Japan, right? So uh, they're like, in their prime or reaching their prime Japanese right now for rookie and, year. and joining uh, the MLB as, as rookies at as a grown adult men. So I think it's just going to make the game easier for them to adapt to. All right. Well, that was all. We'll come back in uh, seven months to see if these predictions worked. <laughs> uh, but, yeah, check us out. Speaking socks, all of our pods. We're going to come back next episode talking about the uh, – Baseball, I'm sorry, we're talking about the NFL, some of the offseason moves, talk about some basketball, talk about some hockey, Mm -hmm. and then again, opening day baseball. Opening day baseball. Gotta love it. We'll see you guys next time. Follow us on all the socials at Tipsy Tailgate Media. Peace.